Hello thinkers. Are you hyped about creative projects using joysticks? Whether it's for game controllers or radio control for your car, you'll need an ESP32 board, a two-axis potentiometer joystick, a breadboard, and some jumper wires. There's one pin for the switch. We won't cover the switch here, as we have a separate video about it, link in the description. Make sure the input pins you select can read analog signals. If you're new to ESP32, check out our dedicated introduction video, link in the description. Now, open your Arduino IDE, and let's take a look at our code. We assign pins 34 and 35 to the X and Y axes, and pin 32 to the switch. We set the baud rate to 115,200, which determines how fast the ESP32 communicates with a computer. In the loop, we continuously read the joystick state using the analog read function and print the result using serial print. Next, connect your device and upload the code. After uploading, you can open the serial platter to visualize the joystick's activity over time. The joystick is composed of two potentiometers, one for each axis. Moving the stick changes the resistance, creating an analog signal. The ESP32 reads this signal as directional input, letting us control movement in two dimensions. Now you're ready to use these tools to bring your craziest projects to life. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more ESP32 tips and tutorials. And be sure to check out our other projects on the channel. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.